pure genius. And a pure genius. On the Christmas Generation game at 5 to 7, Christmas Eve, BBC One. Shouldn't there be another flash now? Oh, never mind. I don't think anybody Let's noticed. Go. OK, right. Oh, who put that flash there? Boxing Day on BBC One. At 6.25, Aladdin Jim conjures up some fairy tale faces, some with feathers, in a big break pantomime party. And at 7, trouble down south for Ian McShane with an old friend from Dallas. What's my little sister been telling you? About what? Then at 8.35, close encounters. Oh, yes. Aliens, is it? Are you totally deranged? A whiff of dangerous comedy at 9.25. Ah! As John Cleese heads an all-star cast in A Fish Called Wanda. Don't call me stupid. Ah! Freedom, yeah! Then at 10 past 11, in a special concert of Hope, recorded on World AIDS Day, George Michael tops the bill at Wembley Arena. Freedom, Boxing Day on BBC One. A charming, enchanting Christmas story on BBC One in 25 minutes in a classic Beatrix Potter tale. First festive cartoon fun in a Flintstone family Christmas. To anyone within the sound of my voice, this is Captain James T. Kirk of the Federation Starship Enterprise. A hostile force has taken control of our vessel. You are a man. We'll see. Star Trek V, The Final Frontier, New Year's Eve, 6.30 on BBC One. You will remember the name of the ship we're cruising on. The QE2. If I'm cast adrift at night, I shall be wearing my hat with the antique Diamante cluster. Pushing the boat out on Christmas Sunday, keeping up appearances, 7 o'clock on BBC One. Over on BBC Two shortly, Paul Rugbenz operates a fantastical farm with talking animals and a hot dog tree in the film comedy Big Top Pee Wee. And in half an hour, the double bill continues with Tony Robinson with the wicked evil sheriff in Maid Marian and her merry men. Before that on BBC One, the classic story of Beatrix Potter's Tale of Gloucester with a little help with Ian Holm and Derek Griffiths in the very special Christmas edition in the world of Peter Rabbit and Friends. <laughs> 